Hello guys, myself Mitra B from Department of Digital Marketing and Data Mining. Today we are going to see about online footprints. Online footprints, establishing a strong online footprints. Uh, understanding the basic of SEO, before embarking on your SEO journey, it is essential to grasp the fundamentals. SEO, SEO is the practice of enhancing your website's visibility on search engine results pages through organic methods. This involves various strategies and techniques that work together to attract the retained website visitors. Keyword research, the foundation of SEO. Keyword or the building block of SEO. Through keywords, Research helps you identifying the terms and phases you target audience is using the search for product or services related to your niche. Once you will, you are identified these keywords, you are strategically incorporate them into your content. Uh, on page optimization, crafting high quality content, optimizing title tag and uh, description user friendly. Off-page SEO, building trust and authority, link building strategies, social media engagement, guest blogging. Technical SEO, behind the scenes excellence, mobile friendliness, site speed and performance, secure website, blog. A blog is an informational website consisting of discrete Often informal diary style text entries, posts are typically displaced in reverse chronological order so that the most recent post appears first. At the top of the web page, until 2009, blogs were often the work of single individual, occasionally of a small group and often covered a single subject or topic. In 2010, multi-author blog features the writing of multiple authors and sometimes professionally edited. Come up with a list of interest. Before you define your blog intention, you should have a general idea of what you want to write about. These interest categories which you are going to write about is known as blog niche. The sky is the limit when it comes to your blog niche. But common topics include the following gaming, style, politics, cooking, food, travel, business or company. Know what not to blog about. Things like private information, both yours and other people's and personal details that are owned uh, to share with pers- uh, people close to you should not be topic for your blog. Also controversial uh, article so post may get your some temporary popularity but it also comes with cons like list safety and targeting. If you have a job that required you to sign a NDA you should avoid discussing activities or topics outlined in the NDA. Blogging about other people is fine as long as you don't or discriminate against them but be aware that they may see your content and retailability. Consider your blog intention. While having in mind a blog topic is a good start, your blog need a specific direction in order to get off the ground. Common reason for blogging in the following through you are you can uh, certainly find your own inspiration. Teach something Uh, best suited to instructed blogs document your experience entertain call to action inspire others spread awareness or the uh, examples document your experience which means goods for travel blog challenges so on entertain well suited to various medium such as uh, such as writing and etc. Call and action commonly used for your business and company blog. Inspire others. This is a category that can stand on its own but may best fit any of the other intention in this section. Uh, writing for web. Writing for web. Strong web writing skill or the key 
component of successful digital marketing strategy and effective search engine optimization though writing for your web uh, comprises a wide variety of different content crafting the right kind of content is especially important for blog and website platform writing for web has its own set of best practices and style guidelines especially because readers interact with web content differently the 